to help states, districts, teachers, and other users determine the degree of alignment of open educational resources to the Common Core state standards, and to determine aspects of quality OER, Achieve has developed a series of rubrics, listed here, in collaboration with leaders from the OER community. The purpose of these rubrics is to provide a structure for evaluating an online resource in a systematic, purposeful, and comprehensive way. There are multiple ways of evaluating a resource. For example, you could use a holistic approach, such as the five-star rating system also used in OER Commons. Or, you could evaluate each of the parts as you can with this set of rubrics. The rubrics can be applied across many different content areas. However, at this stage, the only educational standards that resources can be aligned to in the tool are the Common Core State Standards for English Language Arts and Mathematics. Users should apply each rubric independently to the smallest meaningful unit of the resource or to each OER object as it appears in OER Commons. Rubrics are used to rate the potential, not the actual, effectiveness of a particular object in an educational setting. The following five-point scoring system describes the predicted levels of quality. A 3 rating means the object is superior in that specific area. A 2 means it's strong. A 1 rating means it is limited. And rating an object 0 means it is very weak in that specific area of quality. Users can rate an object NA when a particular rubric does not apply to the object being rated. NA is not a pejorative score. It simply means it would be inappropriate to apply this rubric to a particular object. Also, it is important to note that there are no right or wrong answers in evaluating, only your own opinions of the resource. Please rate the quality of each item as you think it should be assessed, using the rubrics to guide your evaluations. This is what the evaluation tool looks like when evaluating a resource under one of the rubrics. You can mouse over the numbers to learn more about what each rating, superior, strong, limited, very weak, and not applicable mean in each rubric. Again, these are the titles of the rubrics that can be used to evaluate resources in OER Commons. Other videos in this series further explore each individual rubric and what each rating means in the context of that particular area of quality. Please refer to these videos for more information on each rubric.